He just has the biggest district. But uh, next time we'll work on that. So, yeah. No, it's, it's great to be here. It's uh, congratulations. Um, so the federal government's big, bureaucratic, slow. Um, uh, there's a lot of things you can point to to say, you know, what are we doing? Um, this uh, program from the USDA Rural Development is um, efficient, collaborative, and a great return on dollars. It's one of those programs that, that I, as a conservative Republican, can say, this works. And this works for rural America. Because a lot of times, a lot of stuff doesn't work well for rural America. Uh, <coughs> uh, the two million grant, uh, the, eight, the eight plus loan, uh, we like it too because it keeps the local community skin in the game. Uh, you have to make tough decisions for a community like this size to do what you need to do. And I, and it's a tough one. I, I'm not gonna, but it has to be done. So uh, we're glad that we could be helpful. Now, what's the federal government, what's a, a politician's role in this? The U.S. Department of Agriculture is authorized through the Farm Bill. So when you hear us passing a Farm Bill, most of us in rural America, especially in Illinois, think, ah, corn and beans and our safety net for, uh, provisions. But through that authorization, U.S. Department of Agriculture, rural development, we authorize their offices and their programs to go out to rural America to try to get us some of that return on our federal dollars and to help us do things. Then the second aspect of where we're tied as a legislator is, then we have to make sure that we fund the USDA. So if we shut down the government, we're not funding rural development. So that's when keeping the government open is important so that we can continue to do uh, programs like this. Third thing that we do is uh, usually we get requests when there's communities, say, Congressman, can you do a letter of support uh, so that uh, USDA Rural Development knows that their member of Congress is fully supportive of the program? So that's kind of the three roles. You got the the, the folks from um, Doug's office that I know well. They do great work. We've been together a long time. Um, I represent 33 counties. Uh, my largest community is 35,000 and less. So uh, uh, that's why I'm a big fan of uh, rural development, because I've just seen what they've done. Um, but they've done the same way. It's, it's grants, loans, local participation. So it's not always easy, but local folks know when they need to fix the problems, and this is just uh, a way that we can be a partner in this process. So uh, thanks for the invitation. I'm glad I could fit it into the schedule. And uh, I, I look forward to seeing it move forward and, and taking a tour once we're all completed. So <laughs> give, give me that promise and we'll, uh, we'll uh, make sure we get back here. Thank, Thank you all. Thank you.